was a completely different thing altogether to do a musical, to be singing and dancing and leaping around in a big time Broadway show. I really didn't, I mean, I've done all kinds of things, Shakespeare and Tom Stoppard and all of that, but I don't think I even knew what show business was until I did a musical on Broadway. It's, 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 it's magic. It is absolute magic. They're laughing, they're feeding you energy. It's different every night. You have to be on your game. And, and we're also doing something that um, is coming from someplace deeper. It's just magic. It's, it's nothing like a theater. We extended the run because um, we're all old enough to know that when some, you're in something that's really good and it works and you like the people and the reaction to it critically was overwhelming. The audience reaction is standing room only. Uh, don't walk away from it too early. So we were all kind of happy to be asked to come back in the fall. So that, that, that was the reason. Theater is one of the most important aspects of ours and any culture. I mean, you look throughout history and people have always felt compelled to tell stories and put on shows and express themselves. And I think this is, you know, in America certainly, this is the concentration of the best examples of theater. And uh, thank God there's so many throughout the country. And I think it's wonderful to take time to celebrate that. This is a huge part. You know, it's not necessarily the most well-known part of American identity, but it is a huge part of it. Oh my gosh, well, at the rehearsal this morning, it seemed like every face was a face that I had not seen, that I loved. It was either somebody with a headset on, or somebody working backstage, or one of the actors. So, I mean, I'm just excited to see the people that I don't know I'm going to see yet, I guess. Amazing and wonderful. It's so exciting being at Radio City, getting to see all these other actors and actresses. It's really amazing. To think that we're here now is just unbelievable. That was thrilling. How many people get to perform for the president? This is only the fourth president, sitting president, that's seen a Broadway show in the history of Broadway. Do you know that?